Hey look, HP made a keyboard. But it's actually a whole computer inside. This is the HP Elite Board G1A. It's just a keyboard, but inside is an entire computer. It's an AMD Ryzen AI 300 series chip. It's got a built-in fan, it's got built-in speakers, a built-in mic. This model in particular has an actual battery backup built in, so you can actually get a little bit of battery use, maybe like three to four hours. But ultimately, that just means you can take it station to station, take it from home to work, and you know, just can keep where you left off. There are two versions and some little variants, but this one has a detachable USB-C cable, and then you just get one extra USB port. There's another version with a permanently attached cable, and then you get two open ports. But if you plug into a compatible monitor, you get the ports of the monitor as well. In terms of typing, you know, I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I generally don't like low-profile latticeless keyboards like this. I'm kind of a mechanical keyboard person. I'm one of those nerds, but it doesn't feel bad, you know? It's a little bit nicer than your average laptop keyboard and, you know, with deeper travel, but ultimately, if you don't like latticeless, may not be your style, I don't, I think it's all right. There are variants like this one with a built-in fingerprint sensor on the power button. The battery is also an option. Pricing isn't finalized on this. Uh, HP says it should come in starting price of under $1,000 and it's due out in March. Ultimately, even though this is kind of like a straight-laced kind of office-y product, I just think it's kind of cool. It's kind of quirky. I mean, you don't really see a computer in a keyboard, and that's what this is. It's a computer and a keyboard. It's the key pewter.